Good evening, everyone. It's Dr. Shiva Adure. I just wanted to do a quick announcement that some of you may have heard about, um, but just wanted to let you know that this Saturday, October 29th, um, from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m., the International Center for Integrative Systems, which is uh, the center uh, that I started as a research and education institution for system science, will be holding the second international conference on uh, vaccine safety and immune health. Some of you may know, in 2019, we held a similar conference way ahead of all the events that transpired after. And it was really to educate people, uh, not only the public, but the broad scientific community on the need for real vaccine safety studies, but more importantly, on immune health and uh, the modern findings that are emerging out of systems biology in mid-2019, I had been invited to the National Science Foundation um, to give a presentation on the modern theory of the immune system. And anyway, we felt that, um, again, this is in 2019, okay, um, way ahead of the events that took place in 2020 and 2021. Um, but we felt that there was a real need to really have a international conference. And it was a, uh, about 900 people came. This was in 2019, and we're hosting it again in Cambridge. And those of you who want to come, you can come live or virtually, and you can purchase tickets for it. We've made it very, very accessible to people. It's around 25 bucks. And um, I'll talk to you more about that. But fundamentally, at this conference, we will um, review we, uh, the science of the modern immune system. Um, we'll also bring people up to date on the recent scientific studies on vaccine safety that has emerged. Um, we want to invite whoever wants to come, you know, you can be pro or anti-vax, it doesn't matter. It's really to have an open discourse and to have science really prevail versus um, people being on the left or right or pro or anti. We have way too much of that. And I think it's about time that we take a scientific approach, which is what we did. And we led and pioneered this back in 2019. So this is three years later. There's a lot more information out there. Anyway, it's going to be on Saturday, October 29th. 2022. In order to participate, you can go over literally to vashiva.com on, on the shop. Um, you can see there's a tickets here. You can go right into tickets and you'll see there's a thing called Second International Conference on Vaccine Safety and Immune Health. If you go there, um, you can purchase the tickets. It's 25 bucks, so $25. And I hope all of you attend. Alternatively, you can just go to the link, which is in this post, to find out and you can go right to the shop link and get access. Um, let me see if there's any questions people have on the shop. Um, someone says, look forward to uh, uh, reviewing this. Uh, someone says, thank you for all you do. You're most welcome. Yep, and someone says, wow, Stanford Miaro. Um, uh, Maria says, good evening. Good to have you, Maria. So uh, I encourage all of you to share this because um, we, we really believe uh, at the center that there's a need uh, for real science. We live in a very, very divisive world and we hope science prevails. And the agenda of this conference, it'll start at 10 a.m. Uh, if you wanna come in and once you purchase a ticket uh, and you don't wanna come in physically, you, you'll get a Zoom link or you're um, in our auditorium in Cambridge, Massachusetts. We'll put directions up there. You can come uh, and it's gonna be held um, not this Saturday, but on October 29th, Saturday. So I hope all of you can come, but it'll be a real, condensed uh, workshop. You'll uh, get an up-to-date understanding of all the science that's out there on vaccine safety, but you'll walk away with a really beautiful systems understanding of the immune system. But one of the most important things that you'll understand is a need for personalized and precision medicine. That's the way the NIH wants to move. That's the history of traditional medicines. It's really a systems approach. So um, once again, I hope all of you have a chance to attend, and that is the um, uh, let me bring it up again. That is the second international conference on vaccine safety, immune health, Saturday, October 29th, as you can see here, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. It's going to be held at 701 Concord Avenue. And as the uh, blurb says, it says vaccines are a hallmark of modern medicine emerging from an early understanding of the immune system. Systems biology, however, provides for a modern theory of the immune system for precision and personalized medicine and reveals a framework for much needed vaccine safety and risk assessment. So anyway, um, I invite you to invite your doctors, invite other scientists. 
Um, unfortunately, a lot of the scientific community, uh, they're not that educated. Um, if you go back to 2019, you'll see when we held this, we really led the field uh, to encourage people to have dialogue, but more importantly, to let people understand that the immune system is a very complex system. Many, many doctors should attend this conference. So you can, um, they can get up to date. Doctors particularly need it because they're on the front lines and it's um, very valuable for them. Uh, uh, nurses, healthcare practitioners, alternative healthcare practitioners, um, East and West people will learn a lot. They'll really understand the immune system as a system. We'll also cover the fact that starting about a couple of years ago, um, back in 2018, there was a real push for systems immunology. Uh, we'll talk about the fact that the theory that is currently used uh, uh, that doctors learn is actually an old model of the immune system that dates back to 1915. Um, so doctors, uh, invite all your doctors to come, you know, um, educate them, you know, let's, we can, um, many of them are ignorant, unfortunately, it's not their fault, but it's the entire way that they're taught medicine. The way that they're taught medicine is from a reductionist standpoint. They don't get to see the whole, they're taught little parts. So this is a big opportunity for all of you to invite people you've had arguments with, you know, let's share with them the science. Um, so that's what we want to do. Um, and, you know, it's going to be a four hour event. You'll learn a lot. Um, you learn more than you can on your own watching all these YouTube videos. This will get down to the real science. You'll understand what is systems biology. You'll understand computational systems biology. You'll understand the recent advances. But most importantly, we're going to unpack the last three years um, and put it in a framework that you you get a compendium. So anyway, share it with others. I hope all of you uh, attend, take advantage of it. Again, the tickets, you can see the little ticker running below. You, I put the long URL. It's also in the description. Or as I mentioned uh, earlier, you can literally go to the site here. Let me go here. And you can literally go to the uh, vhshiva.com, go to the shop right there, and you can find the tickets right there. And right there is the international conference tickets, and you can get it right here. All right. That's it. Quick video. As, as you know, I'm on the road. Um, share this with as many people as you want. And again, let's educate our health practitioners because uh, they're actually, most of them are in the dark because. Um, their medical systems don't really teach them all this and we have to update them. You'll, you'll be doing them a service um, by bringing them to this event. Okay. Um, thank you, everyone. Um, be well. And by the way, uh, someone's commenting here. If uh, you want to learn more, uh, I will be hosting an open house this Thursday to share with you what is going to be at the conference. You can go to vashiva.com slash orientation. Uh, I, I'll host it um, two days from now, this Thursday at 11 a.m. and at 8 p.m., please come to that con uh, Truth, Freedom, and Health event, and we'll share more what's going to ha happen at, at the conference. Anyway, be well, be the light. I look forward to seeing you all. Bye-bye.